If I told you how the hell this camera angle is set up, actually, I can show you. This is a little crazy. <laughs> Bear with me, niggas. As you can see, we got a pizza box. No, it's not all it takes. A couple jeans, a pair of boxers, and uh, a chair on the bed. A dining chair on the bed, just so we're not crisscross applesauce with our butt crack out, uh, staring at the camera with mad lighting on my fucking ashy lips. What is going on, my beautiful dear niggas? Now today on this beautiful, awesome episode that I have for you. Amazing, hold on. <gasps> oh. But recently, guys, if you haven't heard, sorry. <laughs> my manners where's my manners uh what is going on my dear lovely hot scrumptious thick I remember from the last video thick uh voluptuous beautiful uh, hung like, recently i've been using that word a lot pause hung warm i didn't like that one warm niggas and today on this video uh we are going to be uh talking about a few soundcloud rappers that i feel like they've been biting cardi's uh, little thing and you know some of them do it where it's like this is embarrassing and then other niggas do it where it's like how the nigga look cool biting like three niggas in one and i'm talking of course about sky water because recently I've been hearing uh, his music all around, unfortunately, my Instagram reels. And uh, I'm not going to lie, he gives me like a, a Cardi because of the dermals. Now, when you have the dermals and you're you're doing this thing, because when Cardi, his new music videos, I don't know if you noticed, but like he's never like kind of facing the camera. He's kind of like looking off to the side. So it looks like. He's, he's rapping and doing the music video to another camera that's pointed at him, but he's like doing dances with the actual camera's pointed right here. If that makes sense, so I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try to demonstrate. And it looks like the whole entire time, it's like basically like, why is the nigga filming him when he's not even focused on the camera? And then the other nigga is doing it too, Sky Water. And he has the dermals. Now, the dermals, they're pretty cool uh, piercing. You can A, look like uh, Sky. He makes them look normal and zesty and fruity. And Cardi makes it look kind of cool. He does make it look cool. What am I talking about? Uzi did it, of course, way back. And then sometimes you get these niggas. It just looks, <laughs> these niggas look like they're crackhead. And it looks like they kind of uh, sucked a couple cocks for uh, a line of heroin. I don't know if you can do a line of heroin. I don't know what they do with the heroin, but that's what it looks like when these type of niggas get the get the piercings and it's like, okay, we know you're dick riding, we know you're glazing. It's crazy. But at the end of the day, there's this fiasco going on in SoundCloud where every single nigga is like kinda now every nigga's mysterious, now everyone dressed in all black. They're ruining their whole entire careers with the music. If they keep going and they keep making public appearances they're like hey are you still are you can you like post like your story like you and bay like is, is, is ashley still around we don't know is your mom still around like what's going on like there's just and then boom out of nowhere you just get one fit pick and the niggas like in the cemetery and his head's down and he's wearing all rick and it's like is the, is the music dropping that you said with last month that it was dropping and then there's like some weird i don't know some code there's like some strange caption where it says a lot of hieroglyphics as keyboard hieroglyphics i'm like what what does that mean and then some niggas in reddit are running to that they're like that means he's dropping february 2nd the whole entire time this nigga it's like one pigeon emoji the vampire emoji and then like three number threes and then like his birth his birthday and then niggas are like oh he's dropping then and then the nigga doesn't drop and it's like why are you doing this why are you sacrificing your whole career and you know what's crazy about sky uh, as much as i say that that first of all that nigga's british it's like it's like a whole nother lancy foe experience but except the nigga's music well i would say about lancy foe too it's it's kind of you know it's like it kind of buses because it's like it's different it's not like biting cardi maybe the flow it's given a little whole lot of red or it's like giving that thing but at the end of the day 
the craziest part about all these niggas in the SoundCloud is like <laughs> these emo niggas that clearly bit it from Cardi. I'm not saying all. I'm saying allegedly. We're gonna say allegedly. Uh, when these niggas say uh, when they're in their interviews with uh, the underground nigga, the fat nigga, and they're like, "Who's your music and spoke?" Nigga, dead ass looks like Cardi. <laughs> then he's like, uh, "I've listened to a lot of Deftones and uh, Cigarettes After Sex and uh, Gigi Allen." And it's like, God, come on, nigga, come on. Let's be real here. I don't, I don't know what's going on in the SoundCloud realm. I don't know what's happening. I, the Zest Fest is getting crazy. Is Santana gay? Is Baby Santana gay? But does he go by Tana now? I don't know. He's wearing the crop tops. Maybe this is like some new thing. Cause when you start getting to talk about the niggas more often, like, is this nigga gay? And it's like on everything. It's like new Santana posting this nigga's bellies out. He's like holding his body like mad chill. It's like kind of like three other zesty, questionable niggas behind him with colorful dreads. It's like, what's going on here? We don't know. And it's like the whole entire time, there's this song that he, uh, I don't know if it's actually him, but he's doing like a TikTok to it, Santana. And it's like, he said the most outrageous things. And this sounds like something I'd say when I'm like clock drugged and just like fucking so messing around with the boys. Pause, pause. And I don't know if this is real, but like, nigga is, what's going on? Yeah, I had to open my hole. Suck a nigga dick in slow mo. The hair on my penis, it won't grow. I suck on his dick, he take photos. A court, I'm a slut hoe. I'm a lick, that nigga butthole. And you know I don't give a fuck though. Tell him slow down, he fuck me too fast. If it is whole penis in my ass. Can I suck it dick while we in class? And then Cardi's, I just can't get over that Cardi and Aiden, like, Everyone always says you're not supposed to feel bad for rich niggas. Ha ha, Aiden Ross is a shitty person. He got finessed. But like, if you watch that whole like, what, like eight minute interaction, it's so strange. And it's like, Cardi can't have the excuse where he says, I'm just, oh, I was just shy. Oh, I was just shy. Now, when you're in the stadium twerking and jumping and screaming, yeah, even though that for the whole song, you barely say any lyrics. And it's just like, when you're doing all that and you're, the old interviews where you were doing all that what was happening and I'm, I'm starting to think that the opium niggas are off the opium because I don't know what's going on because when you look at Destroy Lonely that nigga's probably drinking like some water and answered all the questions like honestly and just like the casual conversation now you guys got uh, Ken Carson mad scared to open his mouth or smile because he, he, you guys are going to take a screenshot <laughs> over edit the photo and make him look like the Goomba and it's like what's, what is going on here the, the whole entire underground uh, SoundCloud rapper Cardi Wave whole entire thing it is a very toxic mess I'm not going to lie then you got all these other uh, lifeless garments and these other niggas which I like no homo like pause can we like look it's it's a black guy he's he's he kind of look kind of cool he has like all the he dresses like what are those uh those uh what are those niggas called sixes was nine with the flare skinnies and then he's like it seems like the nigga has a little bit of uh you feel me a little bit of style a little bit of, like kind of looks cool kind of like pause kind of like a it's a nice looking black guy you totally wouldn't think that there's anything wrong and then boom now there's bad allegations it got to the point where this bad allegation you have to change his i think it's a lifeless garbage so there was something before it got to the point where this nigga got so many allegations fucking with these 14 year olds and it's like these girls dead ass are like yo it's easy to tell nigga and it's like whoa <laughs> you can get to when you're old age which is why i don't understand like uh people who are up or people who are talked about or people with like some sort of influence taking advantage and uh, fucking with these little girls and like you got the autumn thing it's, uh, it's just too much going on and i feel like recently i seen cardi in the thong i was like okay whoa <laughs> no bullshit i know for a fact even if it's rick owens there's a lot of other mesh tops where you oh didn't have to God. have like the little the thong connecting where you have to kind of lift one ball side just to, just to snap it if you know what i mean we need to tile it down cardi get off the opium and the molly and everyone get off whatever's going on get off the zesty whatever you can you can express yourself without being cringe or without 
getting minors involved. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. I'm just here to put my two cents in. So you can see as a whole in this very fried, strange YouTube video as to what is going on here. And by the way, guys, new shirt. I just got this a couple days ago. Thought you guys might uh, drop your opinions on it. But that's about it, guys. Um, comment, and subscribe, guys, for more content, of course. <laughs> The, the music's pretty cool. If if you gotta if you gotta uh, fuck a couple minors and do weird shit and like barely talk and get dermals, then I I don't know if I want the music, but I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe, niggas, for more content. Of course, you see that door? I'm gonna do what I have to do. Everyone knows. Um, it. Tilt it right here. Is everyone okay? Is, is there gonna be more SoundCloud rappers? Are these niggas self-aware that they look like biters? Or are they just expressing themselves? Well, Sky, she goes by she, but then again, I heard that you can call the nigga whatever you wanna call. I'm gonna call the nigga nigga. Cause nigga's universal. Um, cover and subscribe guys for more content, of course. I need something, I need something badass to walk off. Jesus Christ. Balenciana, y'all nigga. I already subscribe, guys, for more content. Of course, the niggas I'm gonna see. See, I'm already losing my voice because of how tap the shit is. I'm not even screaming. What the hell? What's going on, Cardi? Talk. And then go. I want Cardi to actually. I don't even think the second uh, thing to Aiden Ross is gonna actually happen. I don't know. I don't know. Peace out. I'm gonna redo it because that was too quick.